Hey everybody, this is Erica the Technology Nerd who likes to film stuff and welcome to the old smartphone challenge. So CES and MWC are now behind us. We've got several new devices, but we tend to forget about the older devices very quickly. So I really want to kick off a challenge with the help of some of my friends. And the challenge is to use an old smartphone for several days to see if it can still operate in today's world as your daily driver. Now, it doesn't matter what smartphone you use, it just needs to be an older one. And it doesn't matter if it's on stock firmware or if you root it or whatever you do to it, it does not matter. The whole idea is just to see how older hardware holds up today and if the nostalgia holds up to today's reality. So as you can see here, I chose the original Galaxy Note to challenge myself with. This is the forefather of the big display. I'm really excited to test this out. Make sure to check out the link in the description for the playlist. We're going to be adding new challenge videos every day next week. So let's see what everyone so far is testing. Hey Erica, Juan Carlos Bagnell here, AKA Some Gadget Guy. And for my old phone challenge, I'm going back to my roots. I wanted to see how far back I could go and still replicate a somewhat usable or functional smartphone computing experience. So I'm going to spend some time, some quality time with the HTC Touch Pro. This is one of my all time favorite memories of a phone. The nostalgia factor is high here. And especially after spending some time with the BlackBerry Key One, just yet another excuse to uh, you know, walk around with some kind of hardware keyboard. I'm really stoked. This is gonna be a fun experiment and uh, thank you for inviting me along. Hey guys, TK Bay here. And for this challenge, I decided to use the HTC MyTouch 4G. This was made specifically for T-Mobile, released back in 2010. It's running Android 2.0, but well, not only that, I unlocked it, I installed CM on top of it, and we're gonna see how this thing handles day-to-day -day activities in 2018. Hey guys, it's Jack and you from Nothing But Tech. For my phone of choice, I'm picking the iPhone 6. I'm gonna be looking at the screen quality and the camera quality, among other things, but I definitely want to see how that compares to flagships. Thank you so much to Erica for including me in this. I'm excited to see how it goes. Hi Erica, Damir Frank here, and for my old smartphone challenge, I chose the OnePlus One. And not just because it's actually the oldest phone that I have that still works, but also for the fact that this, after all, was the very first flagship killer and kind of the originator of the whole affordable flagship movement. So it will be quite interesting to see of how gracefully, or maybe not, this phone is aged, especially since back in the days, at least in some ways, it was already ahead of its time. So let's just see what happens and thanks for the invite. Jason, man, what's that cool new phone you've got? Hey, man, it's the Atrix 4G from Motorola. Super awesome. It's, it's the future. It's, it's the future. It's, it's the future. Super awesome. The Motorola Atrix 4G. The future then. But can it be the future now? Motorola Atrix 4G. Atrix 4G. Atrix 4G. Atrix 4G. Get it now. If you have an old smartphone sitting in a drawer somewhere, feel free to challenge along with us. And if you want to dare one of your favorite creators, have them do the challenge and we could add them to the playlist as well. So this is just meant to be a lot of fun, kind of just commemorating all of our favorite older smartphones. So this has been Erica the Technology Nerd who likes to film stuff. I hope we have a lot of fun with this. Have a good day, you guys. Bye!